What's going on everybody? Just wanted to shoot a quick video tutorial on how to utilize Skype, the features of Skype, and how to add contacts and send files through your Skype platform. Now, uh, if you don't have Skype, you can just simply go to skype.com, S-K-Y-P-E. It is a free video chatting service that you can utilize on your computer to do video chatting, video conferencing. You can also make calls through your Skype for free. You can send files, text messages, things of that nature to people's Skype or their phone. So I'm just going to briefly go through uh, the features of Skype. If my computer will stop acting slow. And what I want to do is I want to show you how to add a contact. So you, I'm currently on my home screen. As soon as you load in with your Skype, you log in. You'll see a home screen. Uh, these buttons right here, you can either make calls. You can do conferences, start a new chat, create a group, send instant messages and files right here. But you can also add a contact. So you'll press this. You'll search for the person's name, either their name or their username. I'm just going to search for uh, someone that is on our dream team. I want to send her an actual file, a video file, that will help her uh, with her campaign. So I'm going to go ahead and add her to a contact. I've already sent the request. So just for the video tutorial purposes, I'm going to send it again. Uh, once you select a name, her profile, or their profile will pop up. You select send request, press send, and down here will let you know uh, the thing that's going on. You can also send messages down here via Skype. Uh, you can make video calls. You can call the actual phone without video. You can add participants or send files and more by selecting this. So I'm going to uh, go ahead and send the file. Or you can send a video message, you can share screens, things of that nature with, and it's, this is all free. So you just press send file, you'll select the file that you want to send. Uh, right now I'm not going to send file because I'm on my other computer, I want to send it with my Mac. So I'm not going to actually send the file, but that's how you would do it. And you'll press send. Now in order for the, peop the person to receive the file, both parties, Skype has to remain open until the download process is finished. If one person... Uh, closes out of Skype, the download will not have to start over. It will just pause until both parties are back on Skype and it will resume its download. So once again, uh, I was just sharing a brief tutorial to show people the, uh, the actual features of Skype and how to add contact and to send files through their Skype platform. Hopefully this video was of help to you. If you liked the video or if you saw something that was missing in this video, feel free to comment below. Like it and share it with your peers. Thank you. Have a blessed day.